A new study is calling for athletes and pro sports leagues to stop endorsing junk food and sports drinks. So a pediatric study that came out the other day wants pro sports and, again, these athletes to stop endorsing unhealthy food and non-alcoholic beverages in an effort to reduce childhood obesity. So the study, which was published in Pediatrics, found that 76% of food and drink products that sports leagues and organizations um, support and sponsor had unhealthy nutritional scores or were sweetened with sugar. Now, we know plenty of athletes endorse these things. You know, LeBron used to endorse McDonald's. Russell Westbrook has Mountain Dew. Kevin Durant used to do stuff with Sonic. Manning Brothers and Shaq do Oreos. Uh, you know, LeBron, KD, Bryce Harper, J.J. Watt, Tiger Woods, other guys endorse Gatorade. All the good um, stuff. All the good stuff, according to you. Mm-hmm. <laughs> he has kind of has All right. <laughs> so my question for you, though, is, you know, based on how, you know, nutrition has become this kind of popular thing and athletes trying to be healthier, blah, 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 should leagues and athletes have a responsibility more of a, and more of a moral compass to get behind healthier products and endorse those things as opposed to promoting the shit that kids shove in their mouths without any reason? A moral compass is get your fat-ass kid out of his house, off the video games, and into the streets. I That's agree. what the moral... I agree with that. That's what the moral compass is. I agree Wait, with that. Why, <laughs> why did he say into the streets like he was just pushing the gang back? <laughs> like, you know what I'm saying? Get the fuck out the room and get your fat ass out there and start running some fucking... Life. Like, kids don't play anymore. They don't ride bikes anymore. They don't play tag anymore. That's why these kids are old. You officially become the old head. That's all my dad used to say. Y'all ain't play, y'all just play the video games. Yeah, yeah, just play the video games all day. They're just sitting there like, I see Toys R Us out of business. Yeah. Toys R Us out of business? Because kids are so busy on the internet watching other kids play with toys. He kind of has a point. That looks fun. <laughs> but a, a, a YouTuber but, that was making toys like that made $26 million in one year, I heard. So but, I might start opening point, toys. Yeah. But athletes, like, listen, we're athletes. The people who actually watch us, I'm, I'm sorry, sweetheart, it's not your son. <laughs> okay, he doesn't know nothing about me. Okay. The kids who watched athletes eating all this junk, they're athletic too, yeah. and they're just burning this stuff off. All right, but the guys that are endorsing this garbage, like the Oreos, uh, LeBron was with Gonzo, are they actually eating this shit? Yes. Yes? Why not? Well, here's the thing. Wait, Why, though, if you're a professional athlete, okay, your body, okay, your temple, shouldn't you put thing. good fuel into LeBron, it? LeBron was endorsing McDonald's when he first got into the league, and there was a variety of quotes where he was like, yeah, I can't eat McDonald's. I used to do that back in the day. Why he was still endorsing McDonald's, switched over to Blaze Pizza, which he has a huge investment <laughs> in. So, hey, look, he, he might be leading the charge. I mean, you know, you got um, Ojo Single who eats McDonald's every morning. I mean, you, you know, we're athletes. We burn this stuff off. My kids, like, you know, if you say, all right, I'm going to eat it, like, I don't... The fatter players who has to worry about their weight problem, like a Kevin Love, has a great diet. Plan. He's a lot healthier than he used to be. Now. Yeah. No, but that's what I'm saying. He has a great di- but that's why he stand out because he has a somebody like LeBron, somebody like Kevin Durant, Westbrook, they can't eat healthy. Why? What do you mean? They, they, burn, pl- so much they burn so much energy that if they decide to eat fucking fruit and vegetables all day. You'd have to eat too much. Yeah, they, they, no, they'd be gone. They'd fucking be twigs. <laughs> disappear. They'd, be di- oh. they'd disappear. So they got to eat steaks and high-carb food just to keep that weight on. All right, what was your diet like back in your heyday? <clears throat> I had, here we go. <laughs> I had two hamburgers. This is every day? Before the game? Two hamburgers. From where, from McDonald's? Yeah. No, room service. Oh, that's two. Got food it's a little bit better than McDonald's, but two, go ahead. Two hamburgers, fries, uh, two scoops of vanilla ice cream, chocolate cake, and a soda. How do you not have a heart attack yeah. already? All right, I miss one. Because I'm playing 42 minutes a game. I'm, that burn, was, I'm burning that all. That was your pregame meal all the time? Yeah, that was my, no, that was my, before I went to sleep meal. Put what? me out. Before you You got to remember, sleep? athletes, you athletes, so you got to remember, athletes need sugar. Yes. We need sugar. That's why Gatorade is important for. Like you just can't be sitting there drinking water. You're gonna cramp up. You're gonna do. All. So we need we need red meat to keep the blood back in. So we need most of this junk food to keep our metabolism going. All right, to keep the is, energy. I, I know it's weird. It's I weird. I get that. It sounds insane though that you're eating. But like I said, most yeah. of our, ice cream, hamburgers before bed. Most most of the guys we've seen that was really healthy. Trash. Really? <laughs> all them trash. All they cramped up. Like, like come on, you got to eat. Like, we used to make fun of, hey, you might want to eat more than grapes, buddy. It's <laughs> 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 like you got 2% body back. Yeah, they look great. Yeah. <laughs> they look great when they took the shirt off. <laughs> Before Instagram, too. So what's the, what's but the every bru- every time they got hit, them bruises stayed longer. They didn't have no cushion. Popeyes anymore. for life. Let's get it. Hey, we out here. I don't even know what Popeyes is. It must be some... I miss me some hood stuff. <laughs> Yo. Never had Popeyes? Wingstop, baby. Wingstop. Hey, hey, give me another high five. Wait, Wing. do they not have Popeyes out here on the West Coast? They do. This is only like two. Never had a Popeyes biscuit? Wait, you've never had Popeyes? 
I was I didn't come from the ghetto, brother. You don't have to That's be from the ghetto to eat Popeyes. <laughs> oh, oh. But you've never had Popeyes in your life. No, we had a Pollo Loco here. <laughs> yo, uh, yo. <laughs> we had a Pollo Loco here, baby. Popeyes, Popeyes. Popeyes. Sponsor the show. Sponsor the show. We need a okay. El Pollo Loco, baby. Let's, can we bring a two piece <laughs> on here? Go there about seven fifty nine. Go there about seven fifty nine when they get ready to close. Oh, they load you up with the chicken. Because we got to throw it away anyway. Or is that just because you're a former professional athlete? Yeah. So the, this was this was the thing in high school. You, you were a star, there, according to us, you were a star in high school. You go there right before it closes because they got to throw the chicken at the way at the end of the night, so they just load the box up. Yeah. Ah! What's okay. wrong with you? What's, how's he never, Smart! <laughs> but how's he never ate, eating Popeyes? In his, he's never yeah, eaten Popeyes. Out, You're tripping. You but don't Popeyes eat Popeyes biscuits. KFC? But you can't eat the biscuits KF, dry. Popeyes is better than KFC away. by far. Popeyes is the best chicken. In the, or like fast food chain chicken. Oh, I, if it wasn't in the area, churches? All right, is this 1976? Why are you eating church's chicken still? <laughs> no, I'm talking about my, I'm thinking about my area. Cap, talk about the charity. And I'm speaking of charity, I'm right, giving yeah, some Popeyes. Yeah. We need to give you some He's charity. He's out of his mind. Some Popeyes. <laughs>